Okay, welcome back to my channel guys. It's peak morning hours right now as you can tell I need sunglasses because it's sunny as hell out. One of those rare days. I have to make breakfast right now because I am hungry as hell and then I will go to Granville Street to get some clips. There's some spots that I want to film at for my own purposes and show you some awesome architecture in that area. Let's get to the meal. Let's get to the streets. Stay tuned. Okay, first we make the french fries, uh, okay? Okay. Might as well go crazy on this one. Next, these are going to be made for the omelette, so I'm just going to chop these mushrooms up because they're going in the omelette. Lastly, we have to chop off uh, the spinach. Brings me back to the time when I was about seven, eight years old. Uh, me and my brother would always order the chili bowl with the bread bun, the bread bowl from Tim Hortons, and we would just we thought that concept was amazing. Anyways, cheers, all of you. I'm gonna eat my breakfast and hit the street. found a little double set over here. I'm just gonna do quick down flat down tricks and plot what's possible. It's a school board, but it's closed as hell as you damn well know why. Um, so I shouldn't get the boot, but I'm just gonna feel it out and do a couple quick foot tricks on this weird little double set. skating with an iPhone 5 previously to this, it definitely fit much better in my pocket. This isn't going to cut it for today, so I'm just going to let it chill. I can at least get a couple manuals on this that I think are sick but we'll find out because literally you have like the length of a board before you have to snap onto the original official manual pad
two times. because the first one I lightly butchered, I just put all my weight into my legs and I didn't think it looked as good as perhaps the second one did. I haven't had a chance to review it, so I couldn't tell you. Let me know what you thought. But I literally thought I was done because like I kept, I tried this and fluked the first couple and I literally just chipped both sides of my tails and then I have less, less tail to work with, so I was kind of bumming. This full tail came off so it literally looks like a flathead. The ground's really rough and that's what happens when you do tricks on rough concrete. So it's all good. I'm hoping I can still get use out of this board while I go to the next spot. It should be okay. I don't know where I'm gonna go next, but I'll find something, so just stay tuned. That's it, yo. Let's go to the next place. I, I don't know about you guys, but I live for buildings that frame the alleyway. I've seen a friend of mine skate this spot once. He popped over this this wall straight into the bank. Literally, there's a wall at the end, so he had to like jump off his board real quick. I'm just gonna try and pop over this this piece here, just into the alley here. He's new to the game. <laughs> hey, bud. <laughs> All right. Into the boonies. like skating here. This would be sick if it was skatable, but it's not. Excellent garden though. I need to buy toothpaste because I've lately been using a chopstick to dig into the toothpaste and actually get it onto my toothbrush because it's so finished that I have no toothpaste left and I have to literally dig for toothpaste. So, I'm gonna go to Dollarama and get toothpaste. I just, that came to my attention and it's very necessary. Is there any sales going on? Any sales? Yeah. Let's go peep some Lambos. Squad day, peep game. Shout out KP. Yeah, yeah. Shout out CTF. Shout out VMG.
bands. Load up the chopper and chop up the running man. two things to do here either go to chill by the water or go to the licorice parlor um, and that's what I'm gonna do okay guys I did it again Woo! you could tell despite having the worst chip tail. Disgusting. Um, I still had a good day. But I'm gonna go home now, I have to cook a meal. I got some nice udon I wanna share with you. And then I'm gonna reheat some leftovers and make it happen. So let's get to the kitchen and whip it up. I recently bought this udon. It's a very authentic Japanese udon. It comes uncooked in rolls like this, so I have much more for my money's worth. And I'm just boiling it at low heat for 10 minutes now. I just have to strain it, put cold water over it, and then I'm going to heat it in the pan. I'm just gonna put some soy sauce in there. I'm just gonna let it cook for a little bit longer. And this is basically red cabbage, carrots, broccoli, and chickpeas, and zucchini. It's real nice and heated, very consistent. Now all I gotta do is plop the udon on top. There you have it, that's dinner. There you have it guys. After a day like this, I want all the udon I can get and I'm grateful for this meal. So thanks for watching this episode. I had a lot of fun just mobbing the streets, finding things to do, observing a lot, seeing architecture, and just capturing it all for you. So that's the end of my video. I'm gonna eat good now, and I'll see you on the next video. It's hot. Shit. Damn. Woo! Check these videos out if you wanna see more videos. Peace out.